on a frightening plane crash out of Massachusetts. Now, we first showed you this video last night on Eyewitness News at 6. The light airplane flipped over next to a runway at the airport in Berkeley. And tonight, we have new details on the accident. Eyewitness News reporter Steve Nielsen joins us now live in our newsroom with more tonight. The investigation continues into the Berkeley plane crash. We've now learned the injured pilot is Doug Cooper. I went to his Bristol, Rhode Island home to talk to his neighbors to find out more. A scene no pilot wants to see. A crushed cockpit after a crash at Merrick's airport in Berkeley. Friends say the pilot is Bristol resident Doug Cooper. He was airlifted to the hospital and survived the ordeal with only injuries to his legs. Uh, Doug is my neighbor. He's been my neighbor for quite a few years now. Um, good guy. Quiet. Doesn't say much. We're told Cooper's plane is over 60 years old and is light. Officials say sun glare was a factor. Friends believe strong winds caused the plane to ricochet off the trees and nosedive to the surface. Interacts with my grandchildren. He's oh, interacts with my children when they were little and very nice guy. Well, hopefully he's going to be okay. I mean... I didn't even know about this. To just, my wife just called me a little while ago. Police say the injuries to his legs are not life-threatening. Linda Craig flies with Cooper and says he called after the Monday evening crash to say he was okay. Like looking at the plane, I can see he's in pain. <laughs> That's pretty messed up over there. Now, there's been two other crashes at that airport before, including one just six years ago. In that crash, the owner of the airport was injured. Now, the Federal Aviation Administration is investigating the most recent one. Live in the newsroom, I'm Steve Nielsen, Eyewitness News.